Hello YouTube, welcome back to Charlie's Corner. Today we're going to be discussing YouTube and the structural power within YouTube. Now, to get started, we're going to be applying the anthropological approach that is uh, broken down in four different steps. The first step is uh, we begin with global in scope. That means everybody in YouTube, so every single YouTube video, every single YouTube creator. Second, we study both uh, people and communities. That's where we begin. And in this particular video, we're going to be discussing the gaming community and we're going to be discussing um, PewDiePie in general. And three, we study the structure of power within that community and that group of people. And four, we believe all humans are interconnected. So let's get started in our case example with, uh, with the structural power in YouTube. In YouTube, uh, a YouTube creator creates videos that are broadcast worldwide to a variety of audience. And many of you guys are familiar uh, with this. YouTube also allows its content creators to monetize their views and make money out of their views. Uh, this allows them to one, increase their income, and two, allows them to make YouTube a living for themselves. Uh, and in order for us to understand the structural power within YouTube, we need to understand uh, who are the main elements in this structural power. So the first element within this structural power is advertisers. Uh, there are a variety of different types of ads that appear on YouTube channels. This includes from little click away uh, type of ads that might be on the bottom of each video. This also includes side ads uh, from recently visited views that appear on the side of a video. And the third type of video is the pre-release, pre-trailer video that appears before every single video. And those are the most expensive. For a complete list of all the type of advertising revenues and how YouTubers make money based on YouTube monetized views, please see down below for a, a link to a Professor Puppet that provides a very detailed explanation on how YouTubers make money. So the first element in the structural power for YouTube is advertisers. The second power is going to be focused on YouTube in large. So this is YouTube that brings together both advertisers and video content creators all into one single platform. And this is uh, YouTube is very strict when it comes to their YouTube policies, uh, such as what can be broadcast and what cannot be broadcast, and what policies each YouTube content creator is going to be broken down into. And the third structural power is us, the audience. And it's you guys watching out there on the YouTube space. You guys, by watching videos, by liking, favorite, sharing, and subscribing, all feed into this system. Advertisers want to promote their products, movies, whatever it may be, and you, the consumer, are there to watch that video. So those three powers are at play. Advertisers, YouTubers, and us, the audience. And whenever we watch any YouTube video, whether it be uh, we have to keep in mind that those are the three powers of play and YouTube content creators have to juggle those things. Sometimes they make videos that are based on you know appealing to their advertisers so they can make more money or provide extra funds or make their channel more well known and two at the same time they have to keep their audience happy. So the next time where you're watching a YouTube video let's try to keep those three things in perspective. One, the audience. Two, YouTube and three advertisers. So all three people, all three elements come together and YouTube content creators have to make a balancing act with all of them. Again guys, this is Charlie's Common Corners. If you like this video, don't forget to thumb it up, like it if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it, you know what to do. And if you want to hear more of my type of videos, please, feel, uh, please subscribe and see you guys on the next one. And before I let you go, go, guys go, I just wanna let you know that I am in the Tribeca neighborhood. And uh, thank you, see you guys in the next one.